So, our first question is, do you own your you own your own home, right? Yes. So is it a single family detached home? Does um, it sit by itself or it's is a, it in a It's a double complex? wide, but we added it. Added okay. It out. But it's just y'all. Mm-hmm. About when did y'all move in? Actually, I moved in 1986. <laughs> you weren't born, probably. Not quite. <laughs> Not quite there. <laughs> um, so, what brought y'all to live in Cordial? Are you from Cordial? I'm originally from Cordial. I was born in Cordial. So, have you been here your whole life? Yes. So, you just stuck around? No, I don't know why, but I did. <laughs> <laughs> so, what type of home? You said it was a double wide? Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, so it's yeah. double wide. Mar- what they used to call the marginal home or something? Uh, the module, module, module homes, module homes. Okay. So did y'all start with something and then build onto it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. So, do you have any solar on your house? Like solar panels. Yep. No. Is that a decision that y'all made, or is it one that you've ever even thought about? I hadn't even thought about it. Ever even thought about it? So, if it was something that was available, what would make you do solar? Would it sage in it? I mean, you know, like light on mm-hmm. your gas, on your bills. Okay. Bill. Mm-hmm. So, if it could save on your electrical bills, mm-hmm. would you have to find out the um, it's hard to talk and spell at the same time? Would you, uh, how would you like to find out information? Would it be best to have like an educational program on it or a publication? What would be the best way to give you information on solar energy? Well, if you could have some information, maybe, you know, like, print it out to me that I could read up on something like that. Okay. So, I'm going to talk about the, excuse me, <laughs> the U.S. for a second. So, I want you to take your pen. And you're going to draw, color, circle, write where you think more solar energy is used throughout the U.S. Any I- You got any ideas? No. Where would you think? What parts of the country do you think use more solar energy? I mean, I don't know. You don't know? Mm-hmm. Don't know? No. So <laughs> even if you... Let's see. So let's see. What... What do you think makes solar energy more appealing to people? You don't know? No. So, would you, like, so, do you, okay, so, let's leave the U.S. there. What about in Georgia? Where do you think people in Georgia would use it? Mm. So, we're more in your, we're right here. Mm Mm-hmm. So, compared to where we are in Chris, where do you think in Georgia would use more solar? Okay. I can get the map that has the counties if you need county names. <laughs> There's only 159 to remember. Oh, okay. You said we're right. We're here. Uh-huh. Okay. So, compared to where we are, oh. where do you think people in Georgia have more solar? Or utilize solar. Oh. You got any ideas? Yeah. Just Maybe take Atlanta. your best. Mm-hmm. Hmm? You think Atlanta? Yeah. I'm going to circle it just so it's a little bigger. Okay. So why would you think Atlanta? Because it's a you know, it's bigger city. Bigger, bigger city. More metro city. Mm-hmm. Do you think that their them being in a metro city has an impact on versus where we live rural rural you think in their metro that they've got more availability yes more availability to it yes 
So if you take that, the metro is where you kind of went. Where do you think are the bigger cities across the U.S. that might use solar? Any guesses? Los Angeles. You think so? You think right in there? You think in Los Angeles? Where else you think? You can give me cities. I can give my best to find them. Oh, okay. <laughs> New York. New York. That one's somewhere over here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's about it, you think? What do you think makes them use it? Do you think it's just because they're bigger cities and they might have more mm -hmm. resources mm -hmm. for it? Mm -hmm. 